Hey, what's up everyone? Pase Baller here. We are now on this February 27, 2023 NBA game day. We only have four games for today. And to kick things off, since it's a bit late now, I apologize for those who waited. Um, I watched the um, FIBA game of the Philippines. That's why it took, me, it took me this long. But anyway, to kick things off, let's talk about Detroit Pistons versus Charlotte Hornets first. That one will actually start at around 7 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. That's going to be 8 o'clock a.m. here in Manila. I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel, Pasay Baller. Please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on that bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded. And for this matchup, the spread that was actually given is minus 6.5, and that's actually given towards the home team, Charlotte Hornets. And before we proceed, let's check on the standings and the rankings first of these two teams, both belonging to the Eastern Conference. Charlotte Hornets, they are at number 14 with a record of 19 wins and 43 losses. And right below them uh, would be the Detroit Pistons at number 15 with a record of 15 wins and 46 losses. All right, so Charlotte Hornets, they would have the home court advantage on this. Um, in terms of fatigue, both teams were able to rest last night, so we can just skip that part. In terms of momentum, it should be with Charlotte Hornets. Man, approaching this game, the Hornets uh, have been on a roll. They have won four straight as compared to Detroit Pistons, wherein they have actually lost four straight. Now, checking on their forms, Charlotte has won four out of their last ten. Detroit has only won twice out of their last ten matchups. Now, checking on the availability and the health of both teams for Charlotte Hornets, Cody Martin is out and PJ Washington is listed as um, doubtful for this game. Now for Detroit Pistons, we got um, Nerlens Noel and Jalen Duran out for this game. Isaiah Stewart and, Bo and Boyan Bogdanovic are both listed as questionable for this matchup. So in this game, Charlotte Hornets would also still have the advantage in terms of health. Right, so it seems like um, all of the factors that we're considering are actually pointing towards Charlotte Hornets. And I guess that's just factual, you know? Charlotte Hornets, they are at home. Charlotte Hornets, they got this momentum four games, man. That's no joke, no matter what you say. You can't win in the NBA four straight if you're, you know, if you're a nobody. Um, plus the fact that uh, Detroit Pistons got more than three players um listed in the injury list that should really you know that should really affect uh, the way they would perform um but i don't know if you've what if you've been watching how detroit pistons have been playing lately yes they have been losing just like what i said they they have actually lost four straight but they are able to manage to keep it close um at first they actually lost by two points i think their last uh, game they they just lost by four so what i'm trying to say is that uh yes charlotte hornets may actually win the game i i don't have any disagreement with that but uh, with a spread of 6.5 i think that's something that detroit pistons can, can cover especially the fact that pj washington uh might not be able to play with charlotte hornets that should really hurt them because detroit pistons is starting to actually um um, uncover and discover how to make use of uh, Wiseman properly. I understand Duran is out uh, for them, but again, they got Wiseman. They got, um, is he available? Uh, um, Stewart, hold on. Duran, uh, it's Duran and Noel who's actually out. Stewart is actually listed as questionable. So the combination of, um, uh, of Stewart and Wiseman plus bag list already available should really hurt them solidify their paint i'm gonna go i'm gonna side with detroit pistons in here but i'm gonna take that plus 6.5 because again um they are not able to uh take home the w but for the past couple of games or so they're able to um take home uh i mean they, they're, they're able to uh, cover the spread so on this one i'm gonna go with detroit plus 6.5 again that's pistons plus 6.5 peace out i say love and God bless.